Assalamu alaikum my very dear friends our today's topic is classification of animals and we have to study the classification of animals on the basis of backbone on the basis of backbone now what is the backbone it is the vertebral column what is the backbone it is the vertebral column now we study the classification of animals on the basis of presence or absence of vertebral column presence or absence of vertebral column okay if what uh, vertebral column is present in the animals if the vertebral column is present in these animals then they are known as vertebrates and if this vertebral column is absent in them these are known as invertebrates as there are very major uh, very fine and major groups of invertebrates uh, but uh, we are reading this topic according to a very short level or it's for five or six class then we just discuss a very few members of this group okay this is for short standard students okay now vertebrates we can define vertebrates like vertebrates are the animals that have vertebral column in them vertebrates are the animals that have vertebral column in them and the same uh, similarly opposite definition is for invertebrates these are the animals are the animals that lake or no vertebral column fine have you understand this thing <laughs> okay uh now we discuss about the classes of vertebrates and invertebrates vertebrates have five major classes how many classes vertebrates have five major classes they are named as mammals okay mammals reptiles amphibians birds and fishes the word fishes is stands for different species of fishes okay and the invertebrates have a major 11 classes but we discuss a very uh, few groups 
like they have insects that are known as arthropods their class name is arthropoda insects and worms these are in the syllabus of fifth class or sixth class that why and that's why i'll discuss only these two groups okay